Hey everyone and welcome back. I am Dan Issel and today we're going to play Torin. I picked this up on the Humble Bundle. Uh, probably about, I think it was on sale like two weeks ago. I thought it looked really cool. I need to turn that down because that's very loud. Um, it looked really cool. It was, I don't know too much about it. I do know that you kind of, it's got some RPG and some puzzle elements and everything like that. Um, I don't think I can get through it in one sitting from what it looked like. It looked like it had a few hours of gameplay. Nothing too much. I'm thinking maybe three hours or so. But it takes place in another world where this girl, you start out as a little girl. And she's, I think she's trying to kill a dragon that plagues her town or something. So she climbs a tower. As the story progresses, she progresses in age and maturity. Her She grows up, basically, and apparently learns lessons. So, uh, that's enough of that. Let's just get into the gameplay. We'll discover this ourselves. I don't know how it's going to play. I did read a few things where it was less than optimized. So, we'll see how that goes. It did look fun, and a lot of people gave it high remark so we'll see yeah, there's definitely a little bit going on I mean it's literally jumping from well now we're at 115 frames now we're at 50 and 70 but it's still just stuttering like absolute craziness move with the left stick I can jump yeah, it's a little slow motion like her jump it takes her like a good two and a half. What the? What? Guess I can't go that way. I mean, it does look really nice. There's definitely a dragon. What? I guess. I don't. I don't know. I guess I'm just gonna keep walking until I get to the dragon and try not to fall off while we're walking. Man, I need to get another freaking headset because this one is getting uncomfortable and the dragon just blocks me just like that and snaps my sword well ladies and gentlemen that's the game oh wait no no it's just spreading evil across this tiny little pedestal we're standing on oh she's handing me a scroll and she's turning to stone and now this man with a magnificent beard strands of cloth hanging from us? I don't really know. Well, the landscape looks nice from what we could see. The hair is not that defined. But, eh, whatever. It was a cheaper game. I believe it's an indie game. I'm assuming it's an indie game. Probably should have did a little bit more research before I uh, made a Let's Play, but hey! Let's do it anyway. So, the scroll that I was holding has become transparent, and I have no eyes. Oh, now it's floating off. This tower is very large. I'm assuming he's gonna, I'm gonna catch it as a little girl. And that was... You know what? That was my mother up there. And that's who I'm going to save. I'm calling it now. That's, I don't actually know, but that's what I'm going with. There's a telescope. It looks like a Coca-Cola bottle. <laughs> and now we're going down the well. I am a baby, and there's blood, and there's a sundial as well. It literally looks like I was just birthed. Um, what am I going to pick up? Is this the part where the baby picks up a sword and then I just go crawling around like I'm dead space zombie baby and kill? And now I have hair. And clothes. Oh my god, I can crawl. Oh, look at the little birdie. Where am I crawling? I am totally crawling for that sword. This is not responsible. X to interact. I just... Oh, bird flew away. Did, I just learned how to walk. I was just birthed. 
and now I was crawling, and I fell. But I'm still walking. Can I sprint? Span button? No. Press and hold X to interact. I'm playing this with a controller because I didn't have it loaded up by the time you saw it, but it said it's recommended to be played with a controller, so... That's what I'm doing. Oh, now I'm a preteen. Nope, talking. Press and hold Y to look. There's a skeleton man with a beard. Am I just gonna straight take his skull? I literally just tried to take his skull. To follow the knight's path, you must climb the tower. The scroll will show you how. There's a pentagram and, um, seven, seven, eight triangles. Nine triangles if you count the one at the root. So I'm assuming this tree represents the tr the tower, I, and maybe each triangle is going to be a different level, maybe, or a different age, or something. Oh, I was supposed to hit a button there. Thanks for telling me, game. <laughs> he has some nice looking horns, though, and a plant. And now I have the plant. This girl is just trying to steal everything. What am I going to do with the plant? What's that? Kick it. Oh, okay. What? Am I going to plant it in this? Yes, I am going to plant it in that. It's going to grow a tree. And the tree is going to get bigger as I play. It is going to grow with me. It's going to symbolize that tree is now me. And as I grow, the tree will grow with this weird sun. Let's just step on the fault. Just kill it so we can end this now. Because it, this isn't fun for a girl. Like, this little girl does not want to be trapped in a tower. I don't... She's probably seen enough Disney movies to realize that girls in towers never meet their Prince Charming when they want to. And now the skeleton man's moving. I missed that. They built a tower. Torin. To surpass the heavens. To touch the stars and embrace the moon. The livid sun cursed their arrogance and refused to leave the sky. Why is all the smoke moving that way while the cloud? Well, the clouds are moving that way, aren't they? Huh. Legend says only a girl bearing of the hearts of mankind, bearing the hearts of mankind, can climb the tower and defeat the dragon and free the moonlight once more. She looks like a Nixia from World of Warcraft. Like that's that's who she reminds me of. I don't know. Maybe they modeled it after her, or they just didn't have any more ideas for a dragon. Or maybe Anixia doesn't actually look like that because it's been like over probably 10 years since I've even seen Anixia, so. Who knows? She might have got a facelift. She still jumps really slow, like that. It's like she just floats in the air like a feather. I don't actually know how long this video will be because I forgot to track the time. I'm trying to keep all my videos around 15 minutes, but depending on what happens. Hey, a deer. Can I pet it? Sneak up to it. Pet it. Hey, I did. I think it's more of an elk than a deer. Can I get... Oh. Okay, I can't, I can't do anything but pet it. Off to the stairs and chest of mystery. Oh, I can never tell what to cut. Oh, it's a puzzle, isn't it? Okay, that was the right way. I guess either I missed something that they told me how to do that, or I was just supposed to guess at it. I don't know. Hey, a scroll. Let's read it. Can I not? There we go. The, this contract of knowledge is written in the, in, on our skin in blood in darkness beneath the well. The tree of life will be revealed. Hidden deep in its shadows, the truth awaits your light. You must defy time, moon child. Oh, 
Let me redo that. You must defy time, Moonchild. Sacrifice your childhood, and you can free us all. So she basically just sacrifices her life. What is that? Let's run to it. Wait. Oh. Oh, it's up in the sky. I really didn't pay any attention to the constellations up there. That's pretty cool. I mean, the game really does look good. There are some issues here and there with it, but I'm not going to knock on it too bad because it really does look good. There's a telescope. Let's look at it. Can I look at it, please? Oh. Was I supposed to hold it? Time mocks the night. Impotent before evil. What does it say? Yeah, it's impotent. Huh. The earth itself reveals... Wait, what? It disappeared. Oh. I didn't read fast enough. Calling his truce a lie... Ancient ghosts litter his past. Am I supposed to just hold it? Oh, oh, the Coca-Cola bottle telescope fell and broke. We'll go and get it. <laughs> She's confused. Oh, okay, so you can fall down the tower. I'm glad she's very strong for her age. And I'm glad she floats like a butterfly. Let's just hope she stings like a bee. That's kind of creepy. Am I supposed to go up here? No? Okay. Let's go this way. Jump. Okay, no, 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 no. That's the one time she doesn't float. Nah. She's bewildered. She's gasping at the magnificent creation of a tower in front of her with giant chains and fire. And that's... No. Oh, wait. No, I can't read that. What is this? Meditate and know your emotions. What? That was totally too fast to read. But yes, we'll enter our dreams. Whatever that may be. As much as it hurts, you must put your wishes aside. Who knows what harm they will bring. I'm so confused. Wait, so he's alive now? Oh, wait, no, I'm in a dream world, aren't I? Makes sense. Hmm. <laughs> Emotion. I'm in a desert. There's a symbol on the ground. Start to grasp the human heart. Follow the footsteps of great men by filling the sac the sacred figures with salt. Oh, oh, yeah. See, I'm not good at these games. I'm very bad at these. I missed. Just just keep... How much salt do I have? I swear it's like I'm at a freaking MLG... <laughs> there we go. It's good enough. The game pretty much just gave me that handicap. The mage, convinced of his righteousness and was blinded by emotion, the ancient beliefs of the desert. Yay, run to the net. There's people down there. And I don't have a weapon. All I have is a bag of salt. feel like a person that just played a 5v5 game versus all bastions. Oh, no, run. Okay, now we had weird cultists, and now we have weird sand piranhas. Oh, that come they come for me. No. Huh. Well, is, I... Oh, they respawn. Woo, run! Run, little girl, run! The little sand piranhas, if you just jump off the thing, they just kind of lay there for a minute. It's not cheating if you just use the bugs that are in the game. It's more of exploiting, and I don't think that's that bad. All right. I'm at an oasis. Get in the water. And I probably drowned. 
Oh, nope, I'm in a crab. There's a crab. Don't eat me, Mr. Crab. I don't want to be turned into a Krabby Patty. See, now it makes sense that she jumps and falls very slowly underwater. It does not make sense to do that in the real world. But then again, I guess that could be a dream as well. And this is just the freaking shattered reality of a woman that got turned into stone by a dragon. Okay, I made it. <laughs> it's like a leap of faith here. I was not supposed to go this way, was I? Oh, I just glitched through the stuff. I don't know which way I'm supposed to be going. I'm just kind of jumping. I wish the fish would guide me. Take me as one of their own. Oh, this doesn't bode well. Catch it! No! I died. I went the wrong way. I probably wasn't even supposed to get as far as I did. That's really harsh. Like, there is no coming back from that. If you pick the wrong one, you're done. You just gotta die and restart. So let's hope that was the only option that I had to fail. What if I touch a crab? Can I touch a crab? Touch it. Touch it. Oh, it turned. I thought it was gonna come after me. Jump! Jump! Slow motion diving. I made it. Okay. That's like a looks like a giant koi. All koi are really giant, but whatever. This is a weird dream for a little girl to be having. Oh, please tell me. Please tell me I make it. Oh. What? Is that thing? Okay. Oh, it's still kind of floating. Jump. Jump. Okay. Am I supposed to go this way? Am I supposed to fall off? Fall. Fall, girl. Don't climb back up. I want you to fall. There we go. Don't touch the purple. You'll die. Don't actually. These are people. These are all people in the fetal position. And holding their heads. They're all holding their ears. Does that mean there's going to be like a loud noise here in a minute? Or they're all going to come alive and start screaming at me in agony? I hope not. I like how she just lands. Like she's got to brace her landing. Because she's falling so hard. Yay, fire underwater. People came from all four corners of the earth to rebuild Torn, seduced by the mage's visions of a paradise of bountiful oceans and flourishing forests. I guess that was the end of the dream. Oh, nope, there's probably my mother. For countless years, solid. But as she failed to appear, his heart faltered. That's my mom. It's got to be. Our future lost in the hands of a foolish child. Well, I completed one part of it. So yeah, they are probably just like little chapters. I'm assuming I completed one. I don't know why else it would be blood red. But, is there a way to save the game? There are only checkpoints. Okay. Well, I guess we're kind of forced to keep going right now until we get to a checkpoint. Let's touch this. What am I doing? I'm turning it. I'm opening the well. Oh, there's a snake on that sundial. I'm trying to break it off. I couldn't just go down anyway. Just happened to destroy... They are some giant skeletons over there in the corner. I don't know if you all saw those. It doesn't even look like that's a well. It's just... Oh, there's a tree growing now. Oh, 
there's a sword. Can I get the sword? See, I'm more interested in trying to grab the sword than this tree growing out of a well and continually getting larger and larger. Looks like a hibiscus flower there. Do, 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 do. I would say this tree is taking forever to grow, but, um, whoa, screen flicker. I don't know if you all can see that. Holy crap, a moly. What am I, am I supposed to climb? Maybe I'm just supposed to. No, I feel like, uh, maybe I should just go up the stairs. See what awaits me upstairs. I'm stuck. There's a branch. Am I supposed to walk on the branch? I'm going to try to walk on the branch. I am supposed to walk on the branch. Very dangerous. I'm going to fall off. <laughs> Stop walking over there. So I'm not supposed to keep going up. I'm supposed to go over here. Hit another branch. Do the same thing. I'm hoping. This little girl is brave for becoming an in from going from an infant to like six years old in a matter of minutes. She has no fear. Okay, so I gotta go out here, brave the wilderness, and come back. What's this? Exit. X. Push. Oh. No, I'm dead. Oh. Oh, don't. It follows. I'm not dead. I'm just stuck outside of the world. Okay. Now I'm dead? I'm not dead. Are you serious? What am I supposed to do? I fell out of the world. I just fell down a tower. And I can't even reload the next checkpoint. Or reload checkpoint. Yes. Oh. Apparently I made it on the rock. Whatever. I'm just gonna take it. Oh. There's a dragon. We're gonna call it here, so thank you all for stopping by. I hope you enjoyed the video. The game is a little buggy, but it looks fantastic, and we didn't really get much done. There looks there was looking like there may be some puzzles or something like that, kinda like with the branches. Uh I figure it's a good time to stop now because we're about to encounter the dragon. We have a checkpoint. We just confirmed that it was a checkpoint because for some reason I fell hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of feet as a little girl and did not get hurt and then continued to pitter-patter around outside of the map. So thank you all once again for stopping by. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you hit that like button if you like the video because it always helps. Leave a comment always you know about the game if you want to see me play anything else have any games in particular you can also direct message me hit the subscribe button if you want to see more and if you enjoyed the content and also don't fear the share button it always helps to get the name out there so thank you all have a wonderful night morning evening whatever it is wherever you are thank you and i'll see you in the next video